Okay, in this short video, I'm going to show you how you can use keyword intent to do keyword research for rankable long tail keywords. Okay, so I'm going to come into the previous search that I did that was for keto diet recipes. And one of the easiest ways to do this with the tool in literally seconds is just to put a filter for the number of words. And you can see instantly that you will get results come back um, for the amount of words that you've put in here. So you can find very quickly some good ideas that you can expand upon. You can even take these and go deeper and do another search with keyword intent. Just open another tab and put the main sort of keyword intent uh, URL in here and you can go and do more searches with it while it's still free for up to 500 results. Okay, now if I just play around with the number of word length in here. You can see if I put in seven, you can find some good ideas and see the search volume as well. So I've done seven and six. Let's have a look at five and you will see a lot more here. This can also give you some good ideas for um, categories, even if you come down to four words in here. Okay, what I've noticed as well is when you start playing around with this tool around the four word length, you start to get these um, ideas with more clarity um, and it's just easier to work with because we get 500 results on the first search. So when you start to filter down by the word count, you just start to see things more clearly. You can find some good category ideas here like dinner, breakfast, um, beef, chicken recipes, um, vegetarian recipes, etc., um, smoothies and um, bread, pizza, all that kind of stuff. It just starts to reveal itself a lot clearer. But if you're looking for more long tail keywords, usually um, the best way to do that is to start about five, six um, words and it will just become more and more clearer for ideas at five words for um, some articles or video content that you can do. And you can see like 1200 calorie keto meal plan that could make a good piece of content. Um, keto smoothies for weight loss although that's kind of generic you can take that and then you can put it into another tab and you can do as many tabs as you want up here you just copy and paste the keyword intent into a new tab and just go and keep doing more deeper searches with it and it all takes literally just a couple of minutes to be able to do that and get these results and so for example the smoothie one in here again we can do the same thing we can put this into sort of five words in six words and you will start to see things more clearly for the ideas for your longer tail keywords and the higher you go up with the word count the longer tail keywords that you can find and you can see the search volumes here as well okay low carb um, smoothie um, tropical smoothie you can see for diabetics you can see here with almond milk etc etc it's just good to play around with it it's really simple and easy to use um, even the free version is really well done. Okay, so seven words and you can find a whole bunch um, different keywords as we're getting into the longer tail here. Um, go and check it out. If you haven't yet, go and check out Keyword Intent. It's absolutely free to use right now and you can get up to 500 words back and you can put as many tabs here as well. Just copy and paste the, the URL, open a new tab and you can just go from the seed keyword search, which you want to do sort of broad search okay so in the, the first instance that I did with this campaign was I started off with just the word kettle and then I went into kettle diet and then I went into kettle res diet recipes and so I just expanded um, or gone deeper each time I've done a sort of broader search and so from that you can dig deeper and deeper and deeper and all within minutes it's very quick very easy to do.